name is name me three programs that are from a male centric male point of view that are on popular daytime TV or online. Okay, name one that's not from a man's. No, point no, of no, view. no, 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 no. See, name one. No. Okay. Name one. Young lady. Young man. Name one. My own place. Okay. I'm 25 uh, years old. How old, am I? how old am I? I don't know. How do you think I am? That's not my responsibility. How old well, are you? See, and when's your birthday? I, I, I don't know your biography. Well, I'll tell you what. I'm trying to be respectful to you. But yeah. here's the problem. No, no, the ultimate problem is every time I ask you a question, you don't answer a question. You answer it with a question. And you're not having a dialogue. You have a point of view, have a point of view. You have an opinion, but you can't back up any of this stuff with any fact. You can't even answer a question. A magazine, a program. Yeah. Uh, lady, I don't think this is going to work for you. So I'm not being hostile. I'm just no, no, I didn't say I you're being hostile. I didn't say you're no, being but hostile. Like, I'm just trying to make sure that, like, no. Both point of views as well. Like I'm trying to have a yeah. Well, here's you can put your point of view on your channel. That's fine. You can put your point of view on your channel. You can say whatever you like, but when you're not even answering a question, okay, what's the what's question? the point? I've said I named all those programs that come I'm just from. I'm because I've been taking notes. I've, I've named all those programs that come from a male point of view, from a female point of view, right? Okay. Name me, name me any programs. Name me three programs that are on daytime TV. Or that are on on level of Essence, Ebony, Madden Noir, Grapevine, anything, Oprah Network. Name me any programs that dominate that are set in there from a man's point of view. There is none. Exactly. So don't tell me about balance and being and being fair. But that's not the woman's fault, is it? I think you'll be a fine host. You'll be up there with Oprah if you wanted to. I mean, like. Oh, don't worry, you, I will be. Exactly. Like, I'm and not here's the point. And here's the and here's the ultimate point. And here's the ultimate point. Why do you think that will be? Because we need balance. Because at 25 years old, I'm 52, and you're actually talking to me as if I'm your age. You're being rather condescending and disrespectful. And even when I try to be reasonable and ask you to have a civil discourse, I'm getting sass and attitude. Where is that appropriate? That's why I asked where's your father or your parents because I don't think anybody would say that's appropriate. I'm not. Okay, but why do you think that's okay? I don't think anything's okay. Actually, by okay, my but time, ma'am, but you've you come onto my you come onto my platform and you have not answered one single question I've asked you that is utterly improper, disrespectful. But I'm not. Because I know that you've said earlier tonight, you said that don't come on and don't interrupt me. There we go. That's your modern woman. That's your modern woman. Your modern, sadly, your modern educated sister. How many times did I bring facts, data, statistics? I can back up what I say and basically, well, you need to give this and that. And you want to argue biology. You want to argue the nature of geriatric pregnancy and, the, and how human beings have evolved. That is how far so many of these feminist, womanist mindsets. This is what so many young Black women are being programmed with. And I need you to ask yourself a question. What kind of companion would she be for a strong man? She would be a pain in the French toast ass. At every turn, I tried to give her a chance to bring it back, young lady. Stop making yourself look like an ass. Let's have the conversation. Never did she even try to answer a question. Now, I need you to ask yourself a question. If you're, what is it like for a man to be dating a woman like that, dealing with a woman like that, outside of the bedroom or something utterly carnal? What's there to be gained? The number one thing that men worldwide want from a woman is cooperation. And